असलम वेलकम टू गोल नॉलेज हब वेलकम माई YouTube family to your own channel which is गोल नॉलेज हब वेलकम टू अ ब्रॉड डे लाइट अ सनी मॉर्निंग एंड मे दिस ब्रॉड डे लाइट कैन एन लाइटन योर लाइफ विल लॉट ऑफ सक्सेस होप optimism a lot of opportunities and major dreams can come true because we are going to discuss in this video a special topic and the name of that topic is how to speak english like a pro with full mastery because i often think it's a dream for many people to speak english like a pro and a nightmare also for some of the people out there at least for those people who love to communicate and even find a job and statistics have shown that it is the lack it is the lack of efficiency on the part of candidates that opportunities are often missed such prolonged scenarios of failure frustration and lack of opportunities can break down a person in the long run i think why should i not come up with few steps that can help you immensely in getting better at your speaking skills like a pro so what are you waiting for watch this video till the end of this video so that you can get the idea what are those novel ways to speak english with full mastery with like a pro with your confidence reflecting from your eyes from your body language and words are speaking and words are coming out through your mouth and you are not struggling the words are natural you are not focusing on too much on grammar your main goal is on effective communication and you are relaxed you are not nervous and you are in a serene position and what are those steps i am going to share in this video so stay tuned till the end of this video but before starting this video and and giving you the solutions rather remedies to your problems to your illness to speak english like a pro there is a small request if you are a newcomer here please like share and subscribe the channel and hit that bell icon because it motivates me to make much more informative videos for you guys in the long run so without any further delay we should start this video and explore a wide world a novel world where you will be experiencing some novel ways to speak english with your confidence with with no more with no more perplexion in your mind where you are not where you are not fighting for your words where you are not a warrior rather you are an achiever first rule remember learning english like a pro involves a combination of dedication effective strategies and consistent practice three rules you have to keep in your mind rather you have to practice if you want to speak english like a pro for that would you like me to discuss a formula for success to speak english like a pro it's quite simple just double your rate of failure experience as many failures as you can number 1 formula to speak english like a pro is turn up the volume speak loud because the only difference between being understood and not and misunderstood is the difference of your volume i am repeating again the difference between being understood and mi- misunderstood is the difference of your volume when people are nervous and afraid they tend to speak with low soft voice and people have difficulty in understanding you in hearing you it is not because of the result of bad english grammar or bad english so english students 
are advised to exercise their mouth and jaw muscles to have clear pronunciation because when you whisper with a bit of your mouth and jaw muscles your pronunciation will not be clear others have problem in hearing you it will show your confidence a low in a low tone so what you are supposed to do i am going to give you a activity so let's practice this activity and turn up your voice and speak loud so yeah so that people can understand you and you will show a lot of confidence what is that activity let's practice this together and if you practice this activity let me know in the comment section that how is it improving your english language like a pro activity is that you have to record your voice for 15 to 30 seconds start with low voice and then gets louder after recording this listen back to it and you will notice that your speaking will become more audible more understandable if you, when you are talking loudly now what happens because and keep it short and simple because keeping it short and simple with short simple vocabulary and sentences with allow you to focus more on communicating your ideas your knowledge and your information and less on grammatical mistakes and your structure so complex sentences difficult complicated complex sentences and too much focus on your grammar will allow you to have lot of grammatical mistakes and confused ideas because your whole concern will be on your grammar so number one activity is to speak loud and keep it short simple sentences because it will allow you it will help you to communicate and to focus to concentrate on more on your ideas on the ideas to be come across to ideas to come across and to be understood by the other speaker number 2 rule the most important rule is relax and focus on communication our memory our brain loves exciting events which make remembering easier then our confidence grows when our confidence grows it helps in effectively communicate our ideas if people are perplexed nervous and they are afraid of making mistakes their in, their speaking performance is often affected and it is a, a survey that 62% of students said that their confidence affected their english speaking performance because their whole attention was on getting the complex complicated sentences there was no confidence there was no relaxing position and this whole scenario affected their english speaking performance because their speaking performance lacked confidence relaxation point of view they were talking either very low they are or they were talking very fast in order to communicate their ideas and in this long run and in this tug of war between communicating the ideas and be better in your grammar skills their speaking performance was totally affected number 3 rule monotone avoid this monotone because when you learn from a teacher or a bookish knowledge text books if you have a monotone monotone there is no up and down pitch there as there are no emotions reflected through your voice you are communicating like if you want to speak like a pro you have to develop these exercises you have to practice these steps but if i say my tone is sometimes higher sometimes low it shows the emotional connection it shows how my voice should be changing according to the subject matter it 
it makes the other viewers it makes the other person audience interested in my speech because i am not a robot i should not follow the monotone i should exhibit this diversity of tones and how you can experience this diversity of tones now comes the point of read widely read widely you have to read magazines newspapers articles blogs whatever comes in your way just read because this variety of reading will give you variety of structures variety of sentence patterns and variety of tones to experience and now your tone will not be monotonous you will experience different kind of language different kind of language patterns and it will grow your confidence when you have vocabulary when you have information when you are calm when you are composed when you are totally focusing on your communicating skills you will speak like a pro with my next point is start listening I totally agree with you that books can help you to learn English language but remember your goal is to speak English like a pro and the best way to do is to watch and to listen the movies because it's both entertaining and the purpose is served while listening and watching the movies you have to make sure that you listen to the pronunciation how the words are pronounced number second thing you have to take into the consideration the pauses in between the sentences they take so in the long run it will be very beneficial for you now comes the next point the connected point start thinking in english now this phase you have to do much more effort to be put in start visualizing start thinking in english because we all human beings think when we see it idle and a survey revealed that an average person thinks about 3 hours a day what could if you can think in english language it doesn't matter what you think it only matters that you are thinking in english language even if you are making a decision for your dinner and remember one thing small objects gets you to achieve your bigger goals and the last point is talk to yourself it's easier because you are only going to give thought give voice to your thoughts start talking to yourself whenever you have personal free time and don't focus too much on grammar because you will get to know about grammar when you are watching tv without any additional effort so these are some of the steps to speak english like a pro and let me know in the comment sec section if you are exercising and this is your assignment the activity which i have mentioned in the very beginning in the very start to practice this activity and then show me and then let me know in the comment section that how would you find this video because i have discussed some of the novel things in the beginning and you have to comment me because i am i am eagerly waiting for your comments and i am regularly reading and replying you in comment section so that your journey of speaking english language can be smooth and it can have fun and uh, and it can be proved a successful journey so with this positive note spread happiness spread positivity and hope and always when you are in a comment section of any video do a tribute and encourage everyone whenever they are doing any effort so this is the message of today with this positive message we end this video till the next video stay happy stay blessed thank you so much have a nice day